There you are, Ignatz. Hello, Lysithia. Do you need something? I wanted to thank you for your actions in our skirmish earlier. You blocked the enemy's approach, which allowed me to maintain my position on the battlefield. I'm very grateful. Oh, you don't need to thank me. Protecting comrades is all part of the job when you're a knight. At first, I thought knighthood would prove to be a task beyond your ability, but you've turned out to be surprisingly dependable. Didn't you come from a merchant family? I sure did. Then if I may, why have you chosen to become a knight instead of taking over the family business? Because I'm the second son. My older brother is going to take over the business. My father wanted me to become a knight so I could help my brother that way. It was a lot to deal with, but in the end, I'm pretty happy with how it all turned out. It's quite commendable to choose a future based on your family's wishes. Oh, it's not so impressive. Your family must have been ecstatic when you were knighted. I suppose they were. To be honest, I am envious of you. You are? I am. I haven't been able to do anything for my own mother and father yet. I hope to be as strong as you and do something equally wonderful for my parents one day. <sighs> You're very considerate of your parents, Lysithia. And I know how hard you work when you set your mind to something, so... I'm sure you can do this, too. Yes, well... If there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. Hmm... Um... That is to say, I certainly will. Thank you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I really should be going. The work of a knight is never done, after all. Hmm... To speak with you, Ignatz. Ah! Oh! Lysithia! You gave me quite the scare there. Do you remember last time we spoke about our parents? When you told me how you wanted to do something for them. Yes, I remember. Does that mean there's something I can help with? No. However, the way you acted when we spoke has been weighing on me. I got the impression you are somehow pushing yourself too far. No, I'm not. What, what would make you think that? There it is again. Something is going on with you, and I think I know just what it is. <clears throat> you wanted to take over the family business along with your brother, didn't you? Huh? I mean, uh, no. I, I never wanted to do that. I'm, uh, not really suited for the life of a merchant. Really? And yet you know so much about paintings, silverware, tea, and other kinds of merchandise. Well, it seems I have miscalculated. I thought you became a knight solely due to your family's wishes. You're not wrong about that. I mean, wait! That's not what I meant! Aha! So there is something you'd rather be doing! Well, um... Yes. Set your worries aside, Ignatz. I have a proposal. You... do? Yes! You should come to Ordelia territory and get started on what you truly want to do. I can arrange for you to come and go as you please, and we may even be able to provide you with other forms of assistance as necessary. Really? Well, I'm certainly happy to hear that, but... But can it wait until the war is over? I still have a job to finish as a knight. I'd feel bad for Lawrence if I just threw all of that away. I mean, he's the one who nominated me after all. You always take your responsibilities so seriously. Do you never put yourself first? Still, 
I suppose that is a rather admirable trait. Very well, then. I will wait until the war is over. Until then, hold on to your dreams, okay? I will, Lysithia. And thank you. I feel like a new light is starting to shine on my life. I don't know what will happen to Ardelia territory when the war ends. Still, if I end up a commoner, it wouldn't be a terrible idea to help him start his new merchant business. That is what he wanted to do, right? <laughs>